You're watching Timberwolf's channel on YouTube.com. It's a nice day for church. I agree, and it will be even better with a new minister in today. What do you mean by that? I told you I was going to go to the head minister about Minister Edwards, and he told me he will have a talk with him. I really wish you did not do that. This is our church, and I'm not going to let some fly-by-night hippie-looking minister bring in people that are not to our standards. <laughs> We're here, it's now time to greet the new minister. I think you better look again. It can't be. I thought the head minister would replace him. Well that just goes to show you, we all can't get what we want, not even you. This is not over, not by a long shot. I will get him replaced, no matter what it takes. That was a great sermon, Minister Edwards. I'm glad you enjoyed it, ma'am. Have a blessed day. Ah, uh, Miss Green. Did you enjoy my sermon today? Why are you still the minister here? Because, Miss Green, me and the head minister agree on one thing. Church is for everyone, not for one's agenda. Mark my words, Minister Edwards. I'll see to it that you are no longer a minister here. You go ahead and do what you have to do, Miss Green. Other than that, have a nice day. I'm sorry for the way Miss Green is treating you. There is no need to apologize for her, ma'am. No matter what she does, I'll still come to your church. Thank you very much, ma'am. Now you go have a blessed day. Hello, Minister. Remember me? Why, yes I do. You're the man I gave that $5 to in the park. Yes, I am. And I wanted to thank you for giving it to me. Think nothing of it, my friend. It was the least I can do. Well, I took that $5 you gave me and I played a lottery ticket with it. And I won $10,000 with it. So I put in $1,000 of it into your collection plate. You did? Why, that was very generous of you. Thank you. Think nothing of it. So, may I ask what do you plan on doing with the rest of your winnings? I put the rest of it in the bank, and I plan on putting my life back in order. That sounds like a great plan to me. Again, thank you, and have a blessed day. Are you an online animator looking for a voiceover for your animation, but only to find out that their prices are well out of your price range? Then why not check out Lucky Pup at Fiverr.com. The Lucky Pup will do your project for just $5 per 100 words. The Lucky Pup has a 5-star rating and has a 24-48 to hour return time. So remember, get a great voice at a great price at Fiverr.com slash Lucky Pup. My mind is now officially blown. Are you surprised about the man you gave the $5 to? Why, yes I am. I'm surprised that he won that money and was able to turn around and give us a thousand dollars of it. Did you know anything about that? No, I did not. I'm not told all the time what God will do. He doesn't? Wow, that's surprising to hear. So, what are you going to do about Miss Green? Well, there's nothing I can do about her at this time, unless she does something against the church. I see. I'll keep you informed if I hear anything. Thanks, Angel. So, what did you want to see me about? I was thinking of starting a petition for everyone to sign to get rid of Minister Edwards. I don't think that will work. Well, I think it will. Here, take this and get everyone in the church to sign it, then bring it back to me. Okay, what will you do with it after I bring it back to you? I will give it to the head minister. Okay, but I still say this will not work. This looks like a nice place to have a cup of coffee. I don't think you want to go in there. And why not? 
It looks okay to me. Because Miss Green is in there talking to one of the girls from the church. Yeah, she's probably in there thinking up a new plan on how to get rid of me. That is possible. I guess there's more than one place to get a cup of coffee. Come on, let's go. This program is sponsored by your local Avon dealer, Jay Lecky. Shop online for all your great Avon products at www.youravon.com slash jlecky. Hi Jessica. Hello Tammy, what brings you here? Miss Green wanted me to get all the girls in our church to sign this paper, it is to get rid of Minister Edwards. You got to be kidding me. I think he's a good minister. I agree with you, but you know how Miss Green is, if we don't sign it she will cause trouble for us. Well I think it's time we stopped listening to Miss Green, she does not run our lives. Then what do you suggest we do? Have you signed the paper yet? No, not yet, why? Give me the paper, I'll invite all the girls to my house tonight to talk about what we should do. Sounds like a plan. Oh, I really needed that cup of coffee. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Mm, but I still can't help but wonder what the heck Mrs. Green is up to. Well, you don't have to worry about that. It has already been taken care of. It has? Yes, it has. You don't happen to know what she had planned now, do you? No, all I know is that it has been taken care of. Hey, if anything bad happened to Miss Green, I don't want to hear about it. No, nothing bad happened to her. Let's just say what she had in mind did not work. I hope we're doing the right thing. Don't worry, by standing together against her there will be nothing she can do to all of us. I guess you're right, thanks Jessica. That's what friends are for. <laughs>